guys! Prom and wedding season is here! Don't think I forget about you now! Here's a classic updo that's more simple than it looks. To prep my hair, I parted it down the middle and installed curl formers to get smooth, perfect curls without having to use heat. Since it's getting warmer outside and we'll be dancing all night, I made a thick batch of homemade flaxseed gel and applied it to each section before installing the curl formers. That way, our hair has less of a chance of getting frizzy throughout the night while you're dancing. And of course, click the links for more details on how I make my own flaxseed gel and install the curl formers. All right, let's do it! Grab the section right in front of your ears on both sides and secure it high up on your head and out of the way. Now take the sections immediately behind the ears on both sides and secure those out of the way. We're gonna work on the back first. Gather the rest of the hair into a low ponytail using a discreet black hair tie. As you're pulling the ponytail through the hair tie, stop halfway to create a loose, low-hanging bun. Then make sure the bun won't fall out by securing the hair tie that's holding it to your head using bobby pins. You should have the ends of your curls sticking out of the bun. We're going to use those later. Release the middle section of hair, and we're going to smooth it back using our fingers. So gently rake your fingers through the hair at your roots only to smooth it out. We don't want to go any further than the roots so we don't create frizz. Once you've done this on both sides, smooth the hair into a ponytail, and again, we're going to secure it with a discreet black hair tie, or one that matches your current hair color. Bring the hair all the way through to create a low ponytail. Now we're going to create a topsy tail. Create a small opening at the base of your ponytail. Insert your fingers through the hole from the bottom and pull the ponytail up, around, and through the hole to create a topsy tail. Split the ponytail in half and working one side at a time, twist each half loosely. Then place the twist loosely around and secure the ends underneath that low bun using as many bobby pins as necessary. Now grabbing those curly ends that stick out of the bun, bring them up and around the bottom of the twist to hide where the twist meets the bun, bobby pinning the hair in place. Now just bobby pin the twist to your head so it doesn't move. Repeat on the other side. Twist the section. Tuck it loosely underneath the bun, bobby pinning in place. Use the curly end sticking out of the bun to conceal where the twist meets the bun. Then bobby pin the twist to your head so it doesn't move. Now release the front. Again, we're gonna smooth out the hair at the roots gently with our fingers on both sides. Be sure to leave out two curls in the front. Now smooth the hair back into a ponytail, securing with a discreet hair tie. And again, create a topsy tail. Make sure it's hanging kind of low. Split the ponytail into two sections, and again, we're going to twist each section. This time, bring the twist around and secure it underneath the twist below it. Do this on both sides. Now 
While placing my fingers in the middle of the twist on the top, I bring them together so they sit directly on top of the twist below and bobby pin in place. And there you go! Now you can leave the front curls out to frame your face or loosely tuck them back. And if you've got a little part from your ponytail, just gently comb the sections together. Now feel free to add any bling for prom or flowers if you're going to a wedding. And that's it guys, a style that looks much more complicated than it is. So have fun, and I hope it helps. Music by Black Mill, your song remix. Check them out below. And check out my vlog channel where we're vlogging every day for the month of April. Bye.